Okay, okay, back with another one, back with another one. Try to get my tool game up, try to get my tool game up. Here we have the rigid dual bevel miter saw. Now, let me explain. This right here wasn't uh, a necessary um, buy, but all the same, it's a good buy. Now, I have a handheld uh, power tool, power saw, but my issue is I can never get a straight cut. Oh, I almost stabbed myself. I can never get a straight cut uh, on the two by fours. Again, I'm not doing no heavy work. It's really some DIY stuff. I want to do something small around the house. So, I, again, I picked the Rigid brand. I'm not loyal to Rigid, but as of right now, I just like it. I like the colors. I like the uh, the, the the durability so far. Uh, and I haven't had an issue, so I figured, why not just stay? Um, I like the Milwaukee brand. Love it. A little expensive for my taste, but if you do it all, all the time, then it's more than work, worth it like the, the Walt, like the Walt too. If you're doing this as a job, then it's more than worth it. You know what I'm saying? Because I heard it's like the top of the line. That's cool. But for me, I'm a DIYer. I want to learn how to do something. You know what I mean? I figure I'll pick middle of the range. So here we have right here is the rigid um, dual 10-inch dual bevel uh, miter saw. <clears throat> I'm sorry about that. So... Let's do this unboxing real quick and let's get into it. Okay, okay, okay. I know this is unboxing, but I had to put you on pause to cut the plat uh the tape. A lot of tape, a lot of tape. And uh again, I'm not it's not I don't do YouTube as a job, so therefore I don't have all the stands and all that. But I might invest in it. Okay. Here you have it. Here you have it. And again, I got to stand up for this because this is a this is a big box. Now comes with a blade, as you can see. Now I, I actually bought a blade, so I'm gonna take that blade back. Uh, I'm gonna, take, I'm gonna end up taking that blade back. So that's good. A little money saved there. Comes with its attachments. Nice little bag to put the attachments in. Um, I feel like it's something in here. Uh, no, it's not. It's nothing in here. Um, just a rod. I guess you can put the that into. So you slide this attachment directly into here. Uh, that's what it looks like. Uh, nice, nice bag. Let me flip it around so you can see it. Nice bag that comes with it. Uh, I guess you can put all your attachments or whatever in there. You carry it around. Uh, now what I do have to do is order like a little tool bag so I can keep all my power uh, saws with me. In this bag right here, let me open it up. It looks like, again, it's kind of hard to do this with one hand. So, it looks like it comes with a tool to um, adjust it. Okay. And it also comes with a little Allen key. Now, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to figure out how to put a magnet on it and magnetize this uh, to some. Or, you know what? Use the bag. Ha, duh. But, um, as you can see, it comes with the Allen key. And it also comes with the, the knob to, excuse my hands, all this... Uh, Washing your hands is killing me. It's killing my skin. Uh, it comes with its own directions. Again, who needs directions? It's like, no, we're going to keep those. We're going to keep those right there. We're going to put that right there because we don't need those. <laughs> All right, let me lift up the top here. Like my little sound effects. Yeah. I gotta make my own sound effects because uh, I'm not a professional. Um, you know what? Let me lay this on the floor and, and put it on the table. Take it out. Hold on. I'll cut you back on. Okay, okay. I pulled it directly out the box. 
as you can see, there's nothing in there. Nothing else left. Empty, empty, empty. Um, just what it looks like when you pull out the box. Come wrapped in plastic. Again, this is corded. Uh, I was looking into the battery operated ones. But again, that's just an extra expense because, you know, you got to get the batteries. Um, and some of them take, excuse me, some of them take two batteries just to power it. So I'm like, if you're using something like this, you want to be plugged into a wall. You know what I mean? You want to get that, you want to get all that juice. So it is what it is. But let me turn this bad boy around. Take the plastic off. Okay, okay, okay. Look at her, brand spanking new. You know what I mean? She even still got some grease over there. Brand spanking new. As you can see, this is what she looks like here. Three little 360 right here. That's what the back of her look like. That's what the front of her look like. Okay. Now, I'm gonna cut that strap on though. Now, they had other ones that had like a little slide. You slide it back and forth, which was fine. But again, I'm not doing no major work. Um, it's something light, you know what I mean? Stuff just, just around the house, you know, DIY type stuff. So, I figured this would be nice. This would be nice for me to learn how to get a straight cut. Um, right where I want it and I have it issued. It comes, as you can see, with a guard. Um, comes with a guard for it, so that's that's nice. Um, I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. I definitely like it a lot. Um, and looking forward to using it. But uh, I just want to let you all see it. Uh, looks like it should be a bag right here. Uh, but it doesn't look like it came with a bag. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Again, I got to do my research on it. But it looks like it should be something attached right here. Maybe to catch all the, the, the dust or whatever. But that's probably sold separately. I'll look into that. And then I'll let you all know about that. Uh, as you can see, you got your degrees right here. You know what I mean? Uh, which way you want to cut. So, I mean, it, look, it looks fairly good. It looks fairly good. I can't wait to use it. Uh, again, just, just get my tool game up so I can start, uh, like really doing work, uh, around the crib. So there you have it. There's the unboxes. This is the 10 inch miter saw from Bridget. And as you can see, really digging it, really digging it. It comes with his own saws and known as his own attachments. It was boxed very, very nicely, but, uh, yeah, got this from Home Depot. There you have it. Some light. Be blessed out there. One.